We all know Coach Sue Semerow is in charge of the Florida State women's great season on the court, but the real question is, who's in charge behind the scenes? Melissa, she does do a lot of stuff behind the scenes. Um, I think a lot of the work she does goes unnoticed. She schedules all our games. Um, she takes all us home for our senior year and gets us to play in front of our crowd. Um, I mean, the hotels we stay at, the restaurants we eat at, the trips we've taken to Mexico, the Bahamas, Africa, like, she does a lot for us. My job entails a lot of the details. Logistics maybe would be the easiest way to describe it. Um, it's a lot of travel plans, it's our budget, it's dealing with compliance, it's working with our equipment manager, um, it's kind of being a liaison to a lot of different departments on campus. Really, um, anything I can do to take the load off of our coaches. Although she may not be the one to teach the women how to up their game, she's the one who makes the traveling experience more than just basketball. I go out and do anything fun. For example, when we were in New York this year, we got to go to Memphis, the musical, and, and see that. Um, so when we go to various cities maybe that we haven't been before, we do try to do something fun. We kind of, we stick together off the court, so that makes it a lot more fun. Um, I think too, when we went to the Bahamas, we got everybody out there banana boating and jet skiing and there was people flying off thinking they were drowning and it was just fun. When we're on the road, I mean, I handle everything from buses to flights to hotels to meals. On game day, it's a pretty regimented routine. We have study hall in the mornings, uh, then we go to a pregame shoot around, we come back, we watch film, we have a pregame meal and we go to the game. So. It may look like it's all fun and games, but the women do learn some valuable life lessons along the way. So we went to South Africa last year. That was a, a totally different experience. It was an amazing experience, really um, life-changing for a lot of folks and uh, just a, an outstanding, remarkable time that we had there. Just kind of being put in that kind of situation in that type of environment was just kind of like shocking for us. And it was just kind of like a slap in the face, like people are really living like this. and. There's a lot of things that we take for granted back home, and um, it really opened our eyes to a lot of things, a lot of struggles that are around the world. With no doubt, all of the things that are planned off the court for the team gives them a stronger bond during the game, which makes Melissa's job worthwhile. It's a lot of fun. I work with great people and great athletes, and uh, that makes it all worthwhile. Being with a group of people that don't mind sticking together makes it fun. My favorite part is just um, that I don't know what to expect every day. Every day is going to be different. Um, there's, there's no boredom uh, that gets involved. It, it's crazy. It's fun. It's a lot of work. Um, being around the, the coaches and really um, feeling a part of a, a big Seminole family um, makes it all worthwhile. And the Seminole team is more than just a family. All of the hard work that goes on behind the scenes has formed this group into a dynasty. I'm Melanie Orleans for Seminole Sports Magazine.